India has taken a huge step to take a giant leap in research and innovation. Prime Minister Narendra Modi has inaugurated the Emerging Science, Technology and Innovation Conclave 2025 at the Bharat Mandapam in New Delhi, unveiling an ambitious 1 lakh crore rupees or around 11.5 billion US dollars scheme to boost research and development in the country. Giving a boost to India's R&D ecosystem, Prime Minister launched 1 lakh crore rupees research, development and innovation scheme at Emerging Science, Technology and Innovation Conclave 2025 in New Delhi on Monday. Scheme aims at creating a private sector-driven innovation environment and strengthening the country's scientific infrastructure. Our is that the private sector mein bhi रिसर्च एंड डेवलपमेंट को बढ़ावा मिले पहली बार हाई रिस्क और हाई इंपैक्ट प्रोजेक्ट के लिए कैपिटल भी उपलब्ध कराई जा रही है नोटिंग दैट गवर्नमेंट इज फोकसिंग ऑन ईज ऑफ डूइंग रिसर्च प्राइम मिनिस्टर मोदी सेड द गवर्नमेंट इज सिंपलीफाइंग रूल्स प्रोक्योरमेंट पॉलिसीज एंड फंडिंग टू हेल्प प्रोटोटाइप्स मूव फास्टर फ्रॉम लैब टू मार्केट he also highlighted India's rapid rise as an innovation powerhouse with R&D spending doubled in the last decade, patents up 17 times and India emerging as the world's third largest startup ecosystem. From space exploration to semiconductor manufacturing, from green hydrogen to artificial intelligence, the Prime Minister said India is now a pioneer of transformation through technology, not just a consumer of it. भारत में इनोवेशंस का आधुनिक इकोसिस्टम बने इसके लिए हम ईज ऑफ डूइंग रिसर्च पर भी फोकस कर रहे हैं इस दिशा में हमारी सरकार ने फाइनेंशियल रूल्स और प्रोक्योरमेंट पॉलिसी में भी कई रिफॉर्म्स किए हैं प्राइम मिनिस्टर आल्सो अंडरलाइन द ग्रोइंग रोल ऑफ वुमेन इन साइंस noting that 43% of STEM students in India are now women, well above the global average. Patent filing may be Bharat mein mahilao dwara saalana field patents ki sankhya ek dasak pehle so se bhi kam thi ab ye saalana paanch hajar se bhi jada tak pohunj gai hai. STEM education may be Mahilaon ka share kareeb 43% hai jo ki global average se bhi jada hai. He announced 25,000 new Atal Tinkering Labs and 10,000 Prime Minister's Research Fellowships to nurture the next generation of innovators. The conclave which will run till November 5 brings together over 3,000 participants including Nobel laureates, scientists, startups, and industry leaders. Deliberations at the conclave will cover 11 key areas from quantum science and biotechnology to energy, environment, and the blue economy. Akshay Dongre's report for DD India.